Ooh. We're still in hell. Yeah, we should probably change the costume. Oh. Well, yeah, I mean. All right, just remember you have a uh, you have that parry move oh, on your stick. So I know that with um. I don't like it. I'm fine with it. Like if I like like if I could get not the hat. The hat's the best part. That's what she keeps on after everything else is gone. <laughs> what? You never heard that old Randy <laughs> Newman song? <laughs> no. You know the guy who sings "You Got a Friend in Me." He also sings a song. I don't know. I know. I know. I know. I know. I know that's Randy Newman. He he also has a song where short people don't deserve to live, which is a parody of racism. To be clear, he is not actually against short people. I think. I mean, let's let's be completely fair though. Mm -hmm. At this point, every single song that Randy Newman does basically just sounds like "You've Got a Friend in Me." But with varying degrees of like minor or major. But it's still basically you got like. Like it doesn't matter what you like. What the actual song is or what he's actually saying. All you still hear is just. You got a friend in me. You've got a friend in me. Short people got no reason to live. Short people got a no reason. <laughs> Short people got a no reason to live. And there's my copyright strike. Well, to be fair, it's a cover, and we're only doing ten seconds worth of the song, so we're good. Um, I guess another Randy Newman song. I mean, but you can leave your hat on. Oh. You can leave all I know, your hat on. All I know is that... There your neighbor's gonna kill me. Huh? Your neighbors are gonna kill me. <laughs> I mean, one of my neighbors has, like, two small children who do nothing but scream. And none of, of that song. none of us are pleased with that. Oh, right, new enemy. Um, this one's kind of fast, so careful. Greed! The dodge windows can be oddly narrow if you're not careful. Well. He, looks he also fucking, has a bunch of ranged attacks. He looks fucking cool, though. Yeah, see, he, his attacks come out fast. There's not much lead on him. Don't forget, while you've got this costume, you can do the, uh... You can do the headbutt counter. Which is push the stick in the direction of the attack as it lands. If you want to be brave and heroic like me. I'm kidding. Oh, anyway, Rupees. Yes! I love it. Baby, rupees. take off your coat. But, um. Real slow. All I know about the, um. The dumb copyright strikes is that I, th I think there was one Game Grumps episode. Where they're talking about how, um, how Dan had sang one, one of his songs, and the episode got flagged, mm -hmm. and they were like, "Wait, but that's my song." This, <laughs> it's, it's like, this song has been flagged by which, which whichever, um, ooh, someone's mad, which, whichever label owns um ninja sax party mm. and it's like but that that's my music that's my that, that, that's my band right i own that they're getting much better at the combat it's also because you're finally like not getting stuck on the buttons being completely different from bayonetta well not just bayonetta but um, yeah, the combat uh, flow. Uh, uh, but, uh, automata. Oh, right, I forgot you can do the spin slash when you do circle Y with the, uh, oh, sorry. You do circle the stick and the sword's equipped. Ow. Yeah, you got hit once. It's fine. It's fine! Practice the headbutt just for fun. If not, I'll do it. <laughs> Ooh, 
Yeah, that shotgun stuff needs to stop. Oh, by the way, even if he drops it, it kind of sucks, so... Like, it deals a ton of damage, but the start of time is so high, you need to just... You need to alpha strike with it. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> well, the problem is solved. Excuse me while I just launch you into oblivion. What is down there? Um... Well, let's, let, let's not find out. Push. Oh, stop. Stop doing this again. Just remembered what. Oh yeah, it's a golem. Great. I love these. I kill hate it. these. Kill it. It's easy to kill. It's also interesting that it's one of the few unaligned creatures that you have to fight. Like, it's not an angel, it's not a demon, it's just a thing. Ow. Not sure you why you thought kicking a laser would be a smart plan. Um... You also weapon swapped again. Yeah, that button's really easy to hit. That's a, that's a problem. There we go. You got this. Okay, maybe not. Oh. If it helps, when you climax, you actually get your health back as you attack. So go not in deep when you, when you when you have to do one with climax. Yep. Ooh. There you go. On the bright side, you only have to deal with him and no other enemies. If this was a fight where I had to deal with two of them, I, I might be worried. I would be a little bit tilted. I think there's a health receptacle in the back corner there that you just haven't been looking at. I'm not sure, but I think there's something in there. It's kind of interesting that, a, you know, an artificial construct like this has a wake-up attack. Or like spins up off the ground to get you away from it. Well, whatever it is, it's dead. Oh, yeah, it doesn't damage anything unless you're locked on to something. Uh, yeah. yeah, no, it's just... Just ruples. It's time to find the tiny boy. Back to the past. Chicka chow bomb Sam Mura Jack. Chaka Yo, chaka fucking chaka. season five was you fucking... You nearly <laughs> hopped into the void there. <laughs> yep. I'm kind of pleased you caught yourself. <laughs> yep. I don't even know what piece of lore that was. I kind of don't care. Lore in this game is not dope. Walk that way, trust me. Well. The door is the only thing you want to pay attention to. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's why. Alright, the sacred artifact is ours now. Dun dun dun. Alright, you've got a bunch of little angry sword people after you, so that's nice. Ooh, I'm. Mm, mm. Doesn't that feel good? Oh, perfect. I am a new type of foe. I also have a badass arm fold, so you know I'm cool. This arm fold is part of my armor. Yep. It is purely. purely cosmetic. Ow. Ow. Ow! You're getting way too lucky and you're out of healing items. Uh, pause menu? Yeah, the pause menu, but alright. Um. Yeah, alright, let's try that one more time. I mean, we're, we're, we're like... You're getting there. We're like halfway through the, through the game. This is our first, like, real death. That's, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, you switched to cough. Good. God damn it! You need to find a way to not touch that button. You know what we could do? Switch it change the uh, change the armor set so that it's so that it doesn't have Kafka. Nah, Kafka's great. I love Kafka for like the one fight. For two fights. Oh my god, we have the Hylian shield. Yeah, you didn't notice. That's why. You no, I didn't. 
Do that headbutt though, it's great. Do it, it's fun. You keep saying flick the stick, almost like what? No. Oh, okay, there. You never we noticed go. he had a whip sword, did you? Well. Yeah, that's a whip sword. There you go, you got it. Are you stunned? I think you can punish. Our fight's a lot different when I have HP, isn't it? Fucking piece of shit. Fuck off. Lower him. Nice. Oh my, really? Yeah, really. We're doing it. You got the harmonious blacksmith. I'll pop that door quick before we leave. And the chest on the left, I guess. Moon Pearl. Yeah. Give, give me the give me the magics. Yay. Having a magic gauge that's full is always nice. Okay. So there's a chest yes. over here. Yeah. Well done. That is a lot of stuff. We should probably make more health potions. Probably. Nothing here, is there? No, there's nothing on this side. Quickly into the doors of nothingness! Wait. Oh, that's actually not anything over there. Wait, do we want to buy items or do we want clothes? Techniques, actually. Like, skills and abilities would be way more useful right now. Hmm. Just gotta put these here. Okay, get ready for probably one of the few times this is super fun. Oh, Jesus. So try to kick all of them on your way through. It's all about... Moon Pearl, yay. Right off, Kiku! I think I missed like one or two. Yeah, but you, you hit the important one. <laughs> yeah, the Moon Pearl. And we repeat this process again. Welcome to hell. No, this isn't hell, this is the oblivion around the Hellgate. It's good that you came in the summer months. In the winter, they can get very depressing. The Deutsch. Franz, we have a visitor. Sorry, just gonna oh, we, quote we're, Dragon Ball. We're so full, oh. I think I was quoting um, Euro Trip. Yeah, because the... Do you remember the... In, in, for some weird reason, for that filler art, all the dudes in Hiffel are have German accents. Oh yeah. Oh, sh I actually forgot that there. That... So, I actually completely forgot that there was actual filler in um in oh, yeah. uh, Dragon Ball in uh, Dragon Ball Z. I need to expose you to all systems to go through later. Cause like, like I know that for the most part, there's like basically zero filler outside of like. The, um, the, hey, let's learn how to drive episode. And then you were just like, oh, yeah. How to there drive was... is essential filler. I don't think it's bad filler. Yeah, that's no, no, that, filler. that's actual, like, okay, hey. that was funny. This actually, like. Akira Toriyama wrote this episode. We're good. Like, like, it doesn't forward the plot. But it is pretty funny. But this is definitely. Solid. To give Piccolo a hat. And he's like, yeah, he's got a skin condition. <laughs> <laughs> but so... What about his ears? Skin condition. Okay, okay, hold on. We are... We are in... An area... Where... Our president is a... Is a... Is a dog human thing. Yep. Also, you want to jump around this curtain? So you can get to the LP. 
So you pop around like so. There you go. Wait. Grab it and then get ready for a fight. Like I know that the, like a lot of people forget that um that there's more than just humans in um in um Dragon Ball. Yeah. But like the fact that we see Piccolo is definitely a like Oh yeah, no no this 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 totally makes sense. So I think during during the cell game we actually do see him and he is he does actually look at Piccolo and is like wait what's what's the demon king Yeah, so you have to fly around it. What's what's the demon king Piccolo doing here? It's a long story. You remember this, right? We were here earlier. Time to recycle assets. But that's always a bad thing. Actually, yeah, no, think, thinking about it, there is actually quite a bit of filler in Dragon Ball. There's a plenty. Like, there's the getting thrown off of uh, Snake, Way. Snake Way. There's the being... Held hostage in Snake the, Way. There's the being stuck inside of the, the snake on Snake Way. Yep. Yep, it's another diving level. Have fun. Fuck. Um... There's the fucking Garlic Jr. nonsense. Which is one of the best filler arcs, actually. <laughs> yeah, because, like... It's like, okay, how do we operate without Goku? Which, like, if... If they had kept the main idea of what Dragon Ball was supposed to be, which was, oh, hey, now it's, now it's Gohan's story. That would have been a really good way to be like, hey, this is how... This is Gohan's first major crisis where he's got to handle it. Yeah. But instead, it was just, oh yeah, um... Now... Now Goku's back. Hooray. Still love how it took you, like, forever to realize, oh, she sinks because she's a witch. I do weigh more than a duck. I weigh more than a duck too, I float. Well, well no, I mean we 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 float. Mm -hmm. So we don't we don't weigh weigh more than a duck. Way as much of a duck. That's not how that works at all, and you know it. Tell that to Monty Python. Ooh, a secret. I wait. Fish. There we go. This will be fun. Let's see how you do. This one's gonna be a fucking awful. He said, "Don't touch the ground." Single combo. All right. Awesome. That's not nearly as hard. Single combo is pretty easy, actually. And you gotta do it against demons. Which make that extremely easy. You got hit enough times to- Okay, okay. I'm like, I don't remember getting hit five times. Well, also, you dropped your combo. That's you started, right. started, and then he slapped you hard enough that your combo gauge just emptied. Not gauge, but... You know. Like, the internal combo gauge that's in our hearts. And is shown on the right side of the screen right there for our convenience. Oh, that's gonna be fun. Don't drop your combo.
Nope. Drop it again. Yep. Yep. Remember, if there's nobody in, in nearby, just hold down the Y button. Yeah. And you'll be able to extend it. It won't look pretty, and your score will suffer, but it, at least it won't be zero. Remember, kids, take the F over the zero every time. I cannot stress that enough as someone who used to not do that and also ended up being like a teaching assistant and had to and had to deal with that. It's like, no, listen. See, if you take an F, that's still 60, which is more than zero. Yeah, the, failed, there, there's, there's at least like something that gets fat. Okay. You drop it again. Okay. You Bullshit. <laughs> Bullshit. You tried different weapons, like Kafka. Ew. Kafka's cool. Kafka's a bug bow. Kafka's your friend. The sad part is, I think this is actually gonna work. I just have to pretend like I'm using the Kelby bow. My buttons don't matter. I just gotta fill them with arrows. Oh my god, this is actually this is actually gonna fucking work. Yeah. What? Oh, uh, uh, uh. Didn't drop the combo. As long as you don't drop the combo. I'm mad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really fucking mad. <laughs> hey, man. Hey man, don't be ashamed. Don't be ashamed of the power of the bow. <laughs> I'm a little fucking salty about that. You should feel salty, because I suggested it. But, um. Go ahead, feed me that rage. God, that should have me. Um. The fucking first time I fought Kieran. How I fucking beat that thing. How'd you beat it? It wasn't with the bow. No. Nope. I was so terrified mm -hmm. of how much damage the Kieran did and how, like, bad I was at dodging all, all of his dumb lightning strikes mm -hmm. that I was just like, all right, so if all you're going to do is just drop lightning on my face... I'm just gonna bomb you. I'm just gonna bomb the fuck out of you. Which is an accurate and smart way to do things. Yeah. Or just, you know, play Gunlancer. I know how. how, how Almost <laughs> lost it there. I know how uh, the Gunlance worked. But, um. Gunlance, just stand there and shoot and charge Wyvern fire occasionally. That's pretty much all you gotta do. There is a boss fight where you have to do two of these guys at once. Ew. Yeah, it's not that bad, actually, because... As long as you can get rid of one, the weapon he drops is good enough to stun the other. Mm. But, like, it was basically just... I had the Mei Lynx hat, mm -hmm. which gave me, like, double bomb damage. My entire inventory was large barrel bombs... Large barrel, barrel bomb, bomb plus, plus okay. small barrel bomb and small barrel bomb plus. And all I did was just drop down large bombs, wait for him to do the dumb fucking lightning strike thing, mm -hmm. and just watch him explode. Or it's just semi random and you're like, okay, I just gotta have to watch the ground and push I the button. Like, this is like Final Fantasy X, but, you know, if I don't do it 200 times, you know, that's okay. I just have to survive. I mean,. It How many was it in Final Fantasy time I have no idea. But, um... <coughs> oh, oh, the... The lightning strikes I, in the I know, Thunderfield. I know what you're talking about, yeah. On Thunderplane, right? Um, yeah. No, what... Screw Thunderplane, for the record. <laughs> it, it wasn't so much random as much as it's like... There is, like, a set... Okay, don't miss. ...area that, um... Don't miss, don't miss. You got it. You got the thing. Okay. As much as there is, like, a set area where where they can hit but the last one was always right on top of the Kieran so I was like all right let me just put all the bombs here 
Oh, that continues definitely what's giving me that silver. Yep. You could have gotten gold. Yep. Well, at least it's done. Yep. At least it's done. It's my turn to embarrass myself. Yep. 